I'm, I'm Dominique Wright Jackson. I'm Brent Rust. Wait, that's it? That was it. Did we mess up already? No. The dog pound is about all things Pasco, all things Bulldog, all day, every day, 24-7. Bulldog's mission is to get the, the hype and the excitement and the attitude, the positive attitude brought up at Pasco High School. So we yeah. really want, when you wake up in the morning, we want you to say, oh, I get to go to school, not oh, I have to go to school. And when it comes to events and activities, whether it's academic or sports oriented, we want you to go, oh my God, I can't believe we're going to a game tonight. Were you at the game last night? No, I wasn't. Oh, you missed out. <laughs> so want we want to pack the stands. That's basically what we want to do. We want everyone, whether you're an athlete or in the art club or speech and debate, we just want everybody there. And we want to create um, a positive spirit a passionate fire for all that is bulldog, all that is purple, and ignite the flame once again under Pasco High. Purple flame. Purple, yeah. Like the ceiling can hold us. Nah, can I kick it? Thank you, yeah. I'm so damn grateful. I grew up really wanna go fronts, but that's what you get when Wu-Tang raised you. Y'all can't stop me. Go hard like I got an eight away in my heartbeat. And I'm eating at the beat like it gave a little speed to a great white shark on shark. We rock, time to go off, a girl. Two, so six, we're actually part of a secret society. Um, just kidding. So I am uh, one of the co-advisors along with Sarah Garza, and Brent just gets to do all the work without being paid for it. Oh, you get paid? Can I say that? So we facilitate all of the student interaction. Um, right now we're doing a lot of leading and a lot of teaching, but eventually we just want to be behind the scenes and have the kids do everything. We want you guys to to lead. Yeah, really, we're, we're getting the ball rolling in a sense that um, there's certain things that uh, students don't have access to. And so, uh, as teachers and advisors, um, we are putting everything together um, and getting the momentum moving forward. And then once it gets to a certain point, and then we basically just hand it off and we just step back and watch the, the magic happen. The people now sing the song and it goes like, raise those hands, this is our party. We came here to live life like no We have a lot. So, um, we do have a spirit app that we use on cell phones that we want kids to check in on and give free merchandise for. The app. Put your finger up. Boop. Right here. See the app? Yeah. Up See the right app? Here. Up higher? Go, go, go to, to the, the app. Go to the app. Spiritapp.co. Um, but that's one tiny component compared to everything we have going. Um, high attendance at games, at um, what, what a, shows, VPA, which is band and choir and drama. Uh, Academic, which would be math activities. Uh, and can you imagine if all of Pasco's geared up in, in purple and they show up to a math competition? And there's like a <laughs> hundred of us there. They'd think we're crazy. We, up to this point, haven't had spirit assemblies or pep assemblies. Starting next year, we've actually um, requested to have an all spirit rally. So instead of just being able to you know, do a sing-along or something like that, we'll do more actual activities, maybe volleyball, maybe pie some teachers in the face and all sorts of stuff like that. So we also help uh, choose spirit days and we're, I guess, like a baby sister or a, a fun mom to leadership. Leadership's like the strict dad and we're the fun mom. I'm a fun um, mom now. Yeah, you are. You're pretty, you look good. You look good. Yeah, we want to, we want to change the attitude. Um, it's, it's not that we had a, a really horrible attitude, but there are a lot of people that are just like, oh, we're not winning, so we're not gonna go. But uh, go. I mean, if you were the one that was on that field, or if you were the one that was in the debate, or if you were the one that was competing in any level against any other school, wouldn't it be awesome that if you turned around and you saw 400 of your friends there? Yeah. Completely changes it. And we wanna be that. We want people to know that if you go to Pasco, you have to deal with the student section. Yeah. Because there's gonna be four, five, six, eight hundred of us there. Mighty, mighty, mighty Bulldogs. Yeah. So we've got some amazing stuff that are in the plans and not everything will come to fruition next year. Uh, we've got some things that take some long-term planning. We've got some brand new stuff that's coming up. 
Um, the hype video was just a really, really small portion of everything that the Bulldog Club is. Yeah. Um, but ultimately, the Bulldog is about a positive attitude and it's about students. So. No, we want it, we just, we want to unify the kids. We want everyone to know when something is, where it is going to be, and we're going to bribe you guys to come and give you free stuff and hopefully oh, free food. Prizes. and prizes. Yeah. The, th the great thing about the Dog Pound is, Anyone can come as long as you're a Pasco High student and you can give your input on anything. So if you feel like there needs to be a spirit day or a day of recognition for something or um, maybe you're in art club and a lot of times we don't get invited to those events, the whole reason we are the Dog Pound is to communicate everything that's happening and getting all the doggy butts we can in the stands or in support for each other. And I think there's a power in numbers. Um, if the Mighty Bulldogs show up to one thing, 400 strong, this school would change completely. We need to be there for each other. We have the Spirit app, we have a Twitter page, um, and then we send messages uh, via both social media, and that that's really it. Yeah, sorry. Who let the dogs out? Hold it, hold it. Oh!